Welcome back to Bristol Limited. Today I'm going to be reviewing unofficial Lego Marvel Zombie minifigures. Before we get um, get into the video, I want to say I'm sorry for not posting. I've been busy with working on Roblox game. First, we have Captain America as the zombie. Good minifigure. It pretty much the same as the official one from the CMF. This maybe the colors is a little lighter. Like on the shield it darker, but on the torso and the legs are a bit darker on this one. But then the helmet is this different molded piece with a buckle going around. Instead of the classic Captain helmet. Next one is Wong. A pretty good minifigure. The only thing really bad down on some other main figures, it like cuts off the printing. He came with this skirt. And I will show I will tell you how much I got this for at the end of the video and who I got it from. Well my favorite, Hawkeye. And if you didn't know, Hawkeye is my favorite superhero. So just the cutting off thing on the arms. Not near as bad because it black on that arm. This hair piece, the same ones that come on mini Hawkeye figures, these pants, but on to the next one. Next one is Falcon, pretty good minifigure, one of my favorite I got in the pack. The detail on the leg is really good, the wings are really good and plus the arms just have the gap being still on the back, which is pretty good. So this the wash helmet, but dirty, look a bit weird, but good enough for being under the helmet. The wings are just these like see-through ones, not the best. Next we have Doctor Strange, my third favorite Marvel character, and overall probably my favorite main figure I got out of this pack because it's super detailed. We have side underarm printing, side leg printing, back, super good back printing, back leg printing. We have printing everywhere. But the only thing bad is that he didn't come with a cape, and the so he didn't have it. But the hair was brown instead of black for some reason. So, but that's an easy fix. Next we have Wanda Massimoth. Um, they are all white figure. The head is pretty ac accurate, but the legs could use more detail. The cloak kind of don't really go with the hair. It kind of like make the shoulder sweeter. So probably my least favorite figure, but still, my use it for Marvel Zombies. Stop motion eventually. Next for probably my second main, main figure. Favorite main figure I got, Iron Man. The head is cool. It looks like him. Arms got really loose. Like this one got really loose quickly. But the detail everywhere under the arms, on the side, and on the back of the legs is pretty good. So a pretty good main figure. Now we'll tell you the price in the company. The company was Timu, we are online store. It takes like, it got sent from like Sina, I think. So it takes like two weeks. But the main figures I've got is super good. None of them have broke or anything. So they will be good. Definitely gonna buy more. I already bought like many main figures. Well, for eight main figures, it was like 20 bucks and low. But mainly not even. I didn't see one that was from 20 bucks. The highest one I got was 16 for eight main figures. But that pack was $10. You can't get them off with zombies anymore. But it was a good order. So. Thanks for watching and see you next time.